I'm here today with Walter, and uh, Walter, I was wondering if you could tell your story and tell us why you came in here today. Oh, well, I came here f in here for uh, stem cell shots. Allographic injection. Yeah, and I have some issues with my both my hips and my left knee. I've had my ne right knee replaced, and the pain's starting to get a little bit more progressively aggravating. On the on both the hips and the knee. What's the level of pain that you have now on a scale from zero uh, to ten? Probably on the two, three level on the hips, on the knee, it varies. It goes from three to four, a little you, bit more. You feel like it's been getting worse? Let's just say if I go up a flight of stairs, okay. I feel it. Any type of incline, I feel the discomfort and the tightness. I've never had that feeling before. Mm-hmm. So now all of a sudden things are starting to change where I just can't even go up a flight of stairs and I'm not out of breath. I can feel it pull back. Okay. And you were diagnosed with? Arthritis. Yeah, I have arthritis in both my hips and my knee. Okay. You also are active with martial arts? The last six months I haven't been able to do much of anything. Okay. Because of just not being able to turn. Every time I turn quickly, there's, mm -hmm. there's discomfort. Okay. So today is January 3rd, 2020. Wow. Yep. And uh, what do you hope to achieve? I want to keep what I have. I want to keep both my hips and my left knee. I don't want to replace them. I've had the right knee replaced. Um, if, if I can, you know, go without doing that, I'll be a happy guy. Hello, today is January 30th, 2020. I'm back here with Walter. It is approximately 30 days post-injection therapy that we that he had for his uh, hip and his knee. And uh, Walter, you seem to have done extremely well with the procedures. Can you tell us a little bit about how you're feeling now? Well, um, in my in my knee, I'm feeling a full range of motion. Which you didn't uh, really, have before? Very, yeah, I know I didn't have that. I wasn't able to kneel on the ground. I wasn't able to do a lot of things. Bending over, picking stuff up was a really task. Okay. And, and even in my hips, um, I'm starting to get a lot more looser. Okay. Uh, I've been doing a lot of, the, you know, when we talk about a lot of the rolling, and it seems to strengthen and up, you know, the lower part of my back into my hips, mm -hmm. and there's not as much uh, restraint. Now it's just more working the rest of the thigh and the leg and that area to loosen up the rest, but it seems to be working great. Okay, percentage-wise, how much would you say overall that you feel uh, since we did the procedures? I'd say about 75 to 80 percent. About 70 80 percent better. Okay, that's yeah, pretty good. I really, okay. I really feel I have that much more energy. Um, you know, I'm not as tired mm -hmm. towards the end of the night okay. after working all day. So, really feeling good. All right, all right. Well, in when you had the procedure, was there any reaction that you had, or is there any side effects that you noticed in any way? No. No. Um, after the injections, I was, the areas were sore, probably okay. from the injections. Mm -hmm. um, but other than that, the next day when I woke up, I was fine. You couldn't feel anything? Mm -hmm. Nothing. Um, and that's when I really, I, I was sitting down having breakfast, and that's when I really noticed my knee. There was no discomfort when I bent it. Okay. In, in a sitting position. And there was no clicking noise in the in, in the kneecap, mm -hmm. which I was hearing a lot of. But even in my hips, there's very little, you know, if I turn the side now, uh -huh. there's no, um, there's no noise, in, you know, there's no popping, there's no, nothing seems to be really making that, you know, a snapping noise. Is this but, something that you would recommend for uh, other people? Being off of the ibuprofen. Mm -hmm. I haven't had any in probably five months now. Okay. Um, oh, just that alone mm -hmm. is great. Absolutely. Good. Well, I appreciate you coming in and sharing your story, Walter. No I'm problem. glad you're doing a lot better. Looking Thanks. forward to your continued success.